Hey, what's up guys? Wilson here. And this is a, a video that I'm going to be posting on Rock's channel. Uh, if any of you guys don't know, I did win his commentary contest for July. And first off, I would just like to thank Rock uh, for allowing uh, us in the community to uh, post in a commentary contest for his. It's a really generous thing for him to do. I know lots of people appreciate it. And I want to thank uh, the judges, or whoever judged this time. I'm not really sure how it was judged this time, but I want to thank everybody that had uh, anything to do with me winning. I appreciate you picking me, and uh, I promise you won't be uh, disappointed. I will uh, do some good things uh, with my new subscribers, and uh, I just want to say thank you to everybody, and I appreciate it. Uh, getting into a little bit of the gameplay here, uh, I got another flawless search game for you guys. I know some people uh, kind of like the last one. I got a lot of likes on it, more than I I've gotten on any of my other videos, I believe. Uh, so, I'm running the rapid fire mini Uzi here. I gotta kind of use something a little bit different. Uh, I mostly post search over on my channel. Uh, it's pretty much all I'll do. I love playing search, it's definitely my favorite game type. And uh, I kind of have to vary up my weapons a little bit because, you know, if I just run around with the UMP with a silencer or, you know, just a, a standard weapon, it gets kind of boring. And uh, I used to run UMP a lot, and my subs were kind of like, hey, dude, can, can you use something else? Uh, so, ever since then, I don't think I've posted another uh, UMP gameplay. I've actually just run around with lots and lots of different weapons. And, you know, just like to challenge myself with different things. And here on this day, I just decided that a UMP, or not a UMP, but a mini Uzi with rapid fire seemed like a nice little uh, combo. So I'm running around, I picked about four or five guys off this last time. And now this guy is probably not happy about how I killed him last time. So I see the Claymore there. Know that I don't need to be running up into that uh, for sure. So I just kind of run around the building and uh, make sure that he's not there. Uh, pick the uh, pick a, another sniper off that's running away with a nice little headshot, and then I see him running away here, and I fail, and then I fail again. And instead of reloading, a nice little tip here: just switch to your secondary. Uh, if I would have just laid down and tried to reload or something, I'm pretty sure that he would have killed me. But I switched to the ever so handy dandy AA-12 that everybody loves so much and I'm able to take him out I believe I got five four or five kills that round um, so a nice little round I ended up picking up a predator and a harrier off that uh, the kill streaks I do run in search uh, may be a bit unusual uh, to some of you I run four five seven simply for the fact that I know that a lot of people run three five seven uh, but if I run three five seven that means I'm throwing a UAV up <laughs> and my teammates uh, get to see where other people are and my teammates see where other people are that means they can kill people and to be honest with you in a search game uh... i want the kills for me um, so <laughs> that's kind of why i run that now here i saw that there was a guy in there he's fired an unsilenced weapon and uh... so i bring out the a12 it's gonna be a close quarter situation and i knew it so you bring out the a12 and i'm able to take him out and here i get a little super fast mode for you uh... because there's a big wild goose chase, and then here in a second, I'm the last guy left. Now there's two of them left, so I get behind this little cover here. Here I got to switch weapons behind me, take him out, but I heard footsteps in front of me before. Uh, so I get back to waiting. I know he saw me fire my weapon, and he would be coming. Uh, so I go ahead and take him out. I am like uh, 10 and 0, 11 and 0, something like that after this round. I'm having a really good game. Uh, it's a quick 4 and 0 game. I thought I would post this game. You know, it's just nice, quick, flawless, and down to the point. Uh, so 3 we're going to switch sides. You've seen my kind of rushing tactics for the last side. You're not going to really get a good feel of how I like to rush off this side. Uh, usually, uh, with something like this, I would pretty much go right down the middle after you avoid the spawn snipe and the noob tube shots, of course. If you've ever played Search on this map, uh, you're going to get noob tubed. Um, it's just part of it. Now throwing that care package out here, a uh, care package can be one of the most strategic things you can possibly throw in a search and destroy game. Now I put it out there because I anticipated they would be rushing down that side. Now obviously they weren't. Uh, this guy had off gotten our spawn really quickly. And uh, 
I was able to take him out, but <laughs> as I ran to him, I almost got killed by my own airstrike, which would have been a huge fail. Uh, now, I'll super fast mode a little bit for you here again, because we're getting down to the last guy in the last round. I go ahead and plant the bomb, and he shoots off the unsilenced weapon again. I run over here to try to get this last kill, because I'm really wanting some more kills, uh, but I ended up getting an assist. But I still get a nice little uh, higher kill flawless uh, search and destroy game for you here. I hope you guys enjoy it. Please come check out my channel if you would like to. Uh, once again, thanks to Rock and everybody who helped me out here. And I uh, hope to see you guys over at my channel. Peace. Thanks.